Well, good evening to you wherever you are in the world. We are just about ready for the action here. Kickoff is imminent. The teams indeed with us very soon, having exchanged their various pleasantries. What I have to tell you is that the weather may not be great for the duration of the evening. The clouds are yet to open, but one suspects that they will pretty shortly. And when the rain comes, we are warned to expect plenty of it. One glance and you know where we are. It is one of the most recognisable arenas for the beautiful game in the world. And boy, does it add to the occasion. They appear to be shaping up in a 4-4-2 formation. Well, the obvious standout in today's football in this system is that it provides you with extra presence in attack. With many shaky defences about, getting the right partnership in that department can pay rich dividends as long as there's a good early supply. So playing two strikers can, um, can be a real help to this team. I mean, 4-4-2 these days, Peter, gets a lot of criticism, but it's, it's unfair. Any system can work if you've got the right players. And already we're on the way here. Did well to step in there, that was more than necessary. Dinks one in. Well, that's one way of trying to make things happen. There's a few who could follow that example. Tries to get it forward quickly. Lille have opted to really stretch the game now. Yeah, that's pretty evident, but what's their thinking? Um, I, it looks as if the opposition are happy to defend the width of the 18-yard box, trying to remove that compactness. <laughs> Out to the left it goes. Is gone. That's a foul. And he is going into that little black book. it away Aspas pumps it into the area can he finish it's anyone's ball crosses it in low and he's there to hoof it away It's Remy dashing forward at pace, tries lifting it over, and it's hoisted clear. And that's been levered clear. Now it's Remy. Is it in? He's done very well to get to that. Well, what can I say? Truly wonderful goalkeeper. Aspas. Yago Aspas. And it's got through. Cut out in the nick of time. Looking to break out here. And helps available out wide. Beautifully done. Yeah, he's pulled him up for that challenge.
tries to stroke it through. Here it comes. And the whistle goes for half time. So now the team has broken through, but certainly not for the want of trying. It's been an interesting game up to now, but still goals. No goals at this stage, but certainly not devoid of action. It is nil-nil here at half time. Whistle goes, and we start the second half. No score in the first half. Who's ready to go for it now? Now it's Remy. He's come through and he's had a quick look inside. And he's whipped it in low. It's gone a long way up and away. Remy, and he's cut it out. And Aspas! Oh, he's taken out. That'll be a foul. Yellow or red? It is red. Looks like he's picked up a bit of a knock from that challenge. Well, there may be some scope for debate over the seriousness of the offence, but none over its repercussions. we we'll have to see out the rest of the game with ten men. Oh, what a save! He had a long way to go. Absolutely terrific, terrific reflexes. Goalkeeping at its very best. well to intervene and dispel the growing danger looking for space out wide and he's got the ball glued to his feet looking to shoot and in it goes an exhibition in how to finish with a minimum of fuss. Deadlock broken, it's 1-0. Look, experienced voices need to be heard now, along with good purpose and urgency, and they can get right back into this. Now it's Remy. Lille showing a little more urgency now, and to be honest, Peter, this is what's required. Well, this isn't the time to talk about risks now, Jim, is it? They just have to hurl everything at it and hope for a break. Spot on, Peter. He's had a go! It's in! Well, you know, thinking about that, I think they've perfected that on the training ground because it took them seconds to get the ball from back to front and they really commit forward in numbers too. It was all very well drilled. The ball's got out of play, and a change is upcoming. Well, his stamina was called into question then, but there's absolutely nothing wrong with his heart and, and the efforts he put in. He was very willing, though, not quite able. 
That has certainly made things interesting. Yeah, it's always a dangerous time when you've just scored. You can easily lose focus and then bang, you're pegged back again. Yago Aspas has been fouled. Aimed into header! Goal at his mercy, and somehow he's missed it. Or maybe the tension around this game played a part in that because he should have put them ahead then. Aimed long and direct. Hit into the middle. And he just whacks it away. Look, this can still go either way. It might be flowing one way, but there's still time for some ebb. Now it's Remy. And that is that. Passion and panache and perseverance, and in the end, parity. A really good game to watch. Your reflections then, Jim. Listen, the more this game went on, a draw was always likely to be on the card. So, overall, I don't think anyone will be complaining too much about what they've got. So thank you very much, Jim, for joining me. That brings us to the end of our coverage. So from us both, a very good evening.